Hey there, my name is Sarah Stern. My game is family business. I've been a certified EOS implementer for five years, and I really want you to fall in love with the magic of the EOS accountability chart. Just imagine this, instead of figuring out who should do which job in the business based on who's the oldest, who's the smartest, who's the tallest, you get to say, what does our family business need in the future? And then who's the right person to do it? Often that person is a family member, but not always. Imagine this too. Every family business I've ever met has what I call the Aunt Matilda issue. She's that family member who's great. Everybody absolutely loves her or him, but they're not great at their job. They don't do great work and that causes problems all around them. When you really, really use the accountability chart in EOS, you can solve both of those issues and it's not personal. It's not about who's mom or dad's favorite, and it's not about what mean thing you're gonna do to a family member by either keeping them around or not keeping them around. It gives you rules to follow and a way to get really focused about what's best for the business, which ultimately tends to be what's best for your family. So take a look at it, use it purely, engage in that accountability chart, and I think you'll be really glad you did.